Hello everyone, my name is Pamon Mark D. I'm the founder and director of Champions Gym. I was born and raised in Perth, Western Australia. So my mum and dad were very fortunate to start one of the first Muay Thai gyms here in Australia back in 1989. It's called Pond's Gym, named after my father, who was a phys ed and soccer player from Thailand. He met my mum here in Perth. Obviously a couple of years later had me. And then one day on one of their travels back to Thailand, they had an official from the government who wanted my dad to open a gym here in Western Australia. Now with the help of my mum, they opened uh, Pond's Gym in a little industrial place here in Os Osborne Park. It was a very basic gym to start up with. It had a ring, had a big open training area, had bags, had pads. Some of the most notable fighters that came out of Pond's Gym in the early 90s were Oliver Olsen, Harold Olsen, Steve Olsen, uh, John Miles, Gary Eid, Khalid Ahmed, Daniel Dawson, uh, Bill Seth, Gareth Van Didden. There were so many different fighters that were just some of the people that paved the way for us here in what we see in Western Australia today. I think a catalyst for having some of the best homegrown WA talent was when my parents brought out the golden era of Muay Thai, some of the best of the best. These included uh, Namkaborn, Koban, Lang Suan, we had Jong Sanan, so many, so many different fighters and they all came out and they absolutely put on a show and showed the people of Perth and Australia what true Muay Thai was. Now, obviously as a kid growing up, seeing all these wonderful Thai fighters come across from Thailand, housing them, running around, getting them to hotels and you know, being a part of uh, mum and dad, making sure they were looked after was, wasn't a really a big deal. But now when you look back, after all these years, you realise you lived in an era of some of the greatest of all time to come out of Thailand in the 80s and 90s. And you know, you look back and you say, that was, that was pretty cool. And um, these people go down history as the best of the best.